Hey guys, welcome to Minecraft. It is Friday, so right right off the bat, this episode's good because it's Friday. And uh, had something I want to talk about. I was uh, on my way home from dropping the kids off at school this morning, and uh, they played a clip from a YouTube video, which is apparently getting like a bunch of dislikes, and it's uh, the Rick Perry campaign video where he talks about how the gays can serve in the military, openly serve in the military, but, you know, this, that, or the other. And uh, he talks about how he's proud to be a Christian and everything. And uh, I just wanted to touch on on his body because it's sexy. Now, I wanted to touch on what he said uh, because <clears throat> it's people... It's it's people like him that really give Christians as a whole a bad name. Like, Jesus, from what I can understand, I'm not a, a crazy religious person. Um, my dad, I was raised Baptist, but... Uh, you know, so all the fire and brimstone stuff, and I mean, like, the extremes of what religion is, and, or, you know, whatever. I don't even know what I'm talking about. I just wanted to say about it was that I, I don't want people to judge. Crap. I don't want people to judge, like, all Christians by like how some act because I know I know some people that that are you know very religious people and they're some of the best people that you can find you know anywhere like for real and and it just it makes me mad when people come out and talk about oh this is gonna hurt when people, you know, they, they want to use religion as a way to hate people or, you know, the way people, certain people are, or they want to use religion as reasons to start war, for instance, because, I mean, n no wars have been fought For a cause, N not. Uh, I'm trying to think of how to put this. I'm I'm tired and it's early, but uh, more wars have been fought in the name of God than if any other you know reason ever. And I, I just I don't get it because that's not what <laughs> that's not what I learned as a child about what you know Christianity is or should be. Uh, I always learned that Jesus was about, you know, wanting to, wanting us all to just kind of, you know, love each other. And just kind of, you know, realize that we're all one global family. We're not, you know, it's not about black or white or, you know, brown or yellow. It's not about the, what pigment color our skin is or whatever you want to call it. it, it it's about... He just, you know, it's just about, it's about love and it's about respecting each other. And it just seems like in, it's 2011, it just seems like we should be able to, uh, you know, just kind of let people be themselves, you know? Why do we gotta, why do we have to judge people based on their sexual orientation, say? Like, or, or, you know, be like, oh, well, you know that that black guy or that white guy why can't it just be like that guy you know and I mean I know that sounds like extremely naive but it just seems like we've it's 2011 I mean it, we're not in 1954 anymore where you know we're not going to take the hose and and spray people down for their beliefs or you know for being a certain certain color and I don't know. It just it infuriates me, and I, I mean, I'm not 
you know, I'm not like a, a speech maker guy, you know, or so you can tell, you know, I'm just like trying, I'm just explaining it from the best way I know how with being as tired as I am. It, it just, <clears throat> it's scary. It's a scary thought that, that someone like Rick Perry could become president in this day and age. I mean, this guy is so antiquated. I don't even, I don't even know what to say. I mean, just the fact that he he wants to. I don't know. Look, I believe everyone has a right to to believe in what they want to believe in. You know, if you if you're a Christian, then more power to you. You know what I mean? That's your right as an American citizen to believe what you want to believe, but. If if hate is something that you believe in, then you need to just, you know, you need to just back the hell off. You need to go away. I mean, this, it's just, it's ridiculous. It's, it's, it's just straight ridiculousness that we can't be better as a, as a species than we are. I, I mean, it's, it's sad, you know, it's just, it's a, it's a sad state of affairs when when we have to be you know like that to each other I mean I I know <clears throat> I know it's naive to think that you know that that people should just be nice to each other and I don't know I, what the whole reason I bring any of this up really is <clears throat> Yesterday was the day that John Lennon was shot and killed back in 1980. It was the anniversary, and you know it's it's, it's it it reminded me of of things like like that Jesus was killed for you know believing that we should all just love each other, and John Lennon was was about preaching peace and love, and and he was killed, and I mean the guy was a nutter. So you can't really be like, oh well, you know, he killed him for his beliefs. He killed him because the guy was a fucking insane piece of shit. And uh but it's just I don't know. I don't know. I didn't mean for this to go off on a tangent like this. It's just it, it drives me crazy. It literally drives me crazy that people just can't be more understanding of one another. And I, I don't get it. I don't get it. Like, 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 you don't like gay people? Well, why? What are they doing to you? You know, you don't like black people? Why? What are they doing to you? You don't like white people? Why? What are they doing to you? And it's not... It's truly not that you hate white people or black people or Asian people or Mexican people. The fact of the matter is, is... Whatever reason you hate that certain race of people or whatever, it's not about them. It's about you. It's about... And also, if, if say, you're like, oh, well, you know, I hate black people because this black guy, you know, robbed me. Or I hate white people because, uh, you know, they would always tease me because of my race or whatever. It's like, it's not... It's not... It's not the white people or the black people that you hate. It's those people that, oh, I don't want to say hate because you shouldn't really hate anyone, whether you're religious or not. But it, it, it's more of it's more of those people. It's not it's not that fact that it, it was their skin color. It's just those were bad people. You know, it had nothing to do with with the fact that they were whatever color they were. Uh, you know, people, there's, there are people that are going to be assholes, and you can't judge an entire, you know, culture or race based on the, the actions of a few ignorant individuals, and that brings me back to Rick Perry, because this guy does not need to be president, because he are, he's these, he's one of the assholes that I'm talking about. You know, you want to you want to believe in God? That's that's more than okay with me. You know, the, that's that's your right as an American citizen to believe in God, but don't use it as a way 
Don't use God as a way to hate. Because I'm pretty sure that's probably not what he was meaning to happen. Now, I'm not saying... I, I don't really know what I believe as far as that goes. I have a lot of ideas and theories. But as far as actually coming out and saying, Oh, well, I believe this or I believe that. I, I can't do that because I don't, I don't know myself. I do know that... I'm not going to I don't believe that that anything that I would believe in would punish me for not knowing or for asking questions about about what it, you know if it's real or like why certain things if he is if God is real why you know does do all these horrible horrible things happen to people I don't think he would be like, oh, well, you know, since you didn't have 100% complete faith in me, you know, you're going to burn in hell. At least I hope he's not like that, because that would suck, but... This just took a wild turn. I just want, I just wanted people, you know, it's, it's Christmas time, you know, it's, it's that time of year, and... Uh, I just think in this day and age, people should just be more... And I don't like the word tolerant. We shouldn't be tolerant. We should be accepting. You know, we shouldn't tolerate, you know, gay people. Or we shouldn't tolerate, you know, other other races. We should accept them for who they are. And, you know. And, and you, you know what? In the words of John Lennon, you may call me a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. And I'm going to just leave it at that.